Today we are talking about why investors are buying Palantir stock hand over fist right now. For more stock news and analysis, remember to press the like button and subscribe. With that being said, let's get straight into the video. Shares of data mining and artificial intelligence pioneer Palantir Technologies has surged by an extraordinary 47% so far in 2024. Palantir exceeded revenue expectations and matched the adjusted earnings per share estimates in the first quarter of 2024. Despite these stellar results, the stock declined by nearly 15% after the release of this quarterly report as investors were underwhelmed by the company's cautious revenue forecast for the entire fiscal year. However, Palantir shares have since rebounded, driven largely by recent profit-taking in the semiconductor and artificial intelligence sectors, and a market shift from semiconductor stocks to software stocks. This software-as-a-service company, known for its unparalleled capability to extract actionable insights from vast amounts of government and enterprise data, continues to offer for much to investors. Here are three compelling reasons to consider investing in Palantir now. Since its introduction, Palantir's large language model-powered artificial intelligence platform has gained significant traction among customers. This platform leverages data analytics and machine learning to help businesses move beyond basic chat functions and effectively implement artificial intelligence solutions to generate real business value. The platform employs ontology and data integration technologies, enabling customers to deploy artificial intelligence intelligence solutions even with disorganized data. It converts unstructured data, such as emails, Slack messages, comments, audio, and images into structured actions and outputs. This capability stands in stark contrast to competitors who assert that only 10% of a customer's data is ready for artificial intelligence applications. Palantir's bootcamp-based marketing strategy is also proving to be highly effective. By the end of the first quarter, more than 900 organizations had participated in these bootcamps. The company has also launched Build with Artificial Intelligence platform tutorials and reference implementations to help customers effectively use the platform for creating artificial intelligence solutions. Consequently, the platform is aiding Palantir in attracting new customers and expanding within existing ones. The United States commercial sector was a standout performer for Palantir in the first quarter, with revenue increasing by 68% year-over-year, excluding strategic investments. This positive trend is expected to continue in 2024, driven by the growing adoption of the company's platform. Palantir reported a robust 69% year-over-year increase in the United States commercial customer base in the first quarter. In response, the company has raised its growth outlook for this customer segment for the full year from the previous estimate of 40% to 45%. Palantir's United States government business also showed strength. The company secured more than $178 million from the United States Army for a program under the Tactical Intelligence Targeting Access Node initiative, enabling it to assist the Army in detecting enemy targets. This initiative made Palantir the first software company to be awarded a primary contract for a hardware production endeavor. The government business, while growing more slowly than the commercial sector, involves a thorough vetting of vendors and provides a stable revenue base for Palantir. Moreover, in the current era of geopolitical tensions, Palantir's government-focused software solutions have become increasingly relevant and may experience substantial growth in the coming years. Investors' reaction to Palantir's fiscal year 2024 revenue guidance appears short-sighted, as the company's top-line growth is likely to be irregular during the early stages of the ongoing artificial intelligence transformation. As artificial intelligence technologies advance and become more widely adopted globally, the company's financial performance will become more predictable. Nevertheless, Palantir's profitability has been steadily improving. The company reported a generally accepted accounting principles net income of $106 million in the first quarter, marking its sixth consecutive quarter of generally accepted accounting principles profitability. The company also reported a generally accepted accounting principles operating income of $81 million and an adjusted operating margin of 36%. Palantir's Rule of 40 score, which measures the company's revenue and profit performance, increased from 54 in the fourth quarter of 2023 to 57 in the first quarter of 2024. Palantir is also generating cash at a rapid pace. The company reported $130 million in cash from operations and $149 million in adjusted free cash flow in the first quarter. It ended the first quarter with $3.9 billion in cash, providing
providing ample financial flexibility to invest in growth initiatives. While Palantir stock trades at 24 times trailing 12-month sales, the premium valuation seems justified given the essential nature of its software in numerous government operations and the rapidly expanding commercial business. Therefore, it makes sense to consider investing in this high-performing stock now. In the end, Palantir Technologies has experienced an impressive 47% increase in its stock value in 2024, driven by strong customer adoption of its artificial intelligence platform and significant revenue growth in its United States commercial and government sectors. Despite a brief decline due to cautious revenue guidance, the stock has rebounded, making it an attractive investment. Palantir's improving profitability and robust cash flow generation support its premium valuation. With that being said, remember to press the like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next video.